Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House. So in today's tiny house video, my dad and I are going to be putting the OSB board on the roof. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is tacking some nails on the very edge of the truss ends to hold the board in place as we get it up there. So let's get started. I guess it matters. You don't really want it to be super flush, but you're going to cover that cover with that titanium stuff. So. You can only put the ladder over there and just double slide it up. I wonder if we should. to put it back out, aren't you? So last week there was a uh, thread of snow. We got about uh, two inches here. So on Thursday, right before the storm, my dad and I came up to the tiny house and we put the trusses up, the OSB board, and the underlayment. Um, last video you saw the trusses being installed, but my GoPro camera decided to take pictures instead of film for the uh, OSB and the underlayment. So I thought I would just kind of run through those two things um, and just show you what we did since you don't get to see uh, the actual installment. So let's get to that. Uh, yeah. um, I don't know what those marks are. If I can find a rock to stop it. So you're looking at the underside of the trusses um, where the OSB board has been installed and it goes pretty much to the end of all of those trusses and over here I made a mistake in using uh, the wrong pitch so I'm going to have to cut that uh, truss short there. Now um, because my building is not quite square you'll see pieces like this kind of a cheater board that was uh, used to nail the OSB on because it was just slightly off that corner let's take a trip up the ladder here I appreciate my neighbor letting me use this 12 foot ladder so here is the underlayment now this stuff is called a uh, titanium UDL and it um, is waterproof vapor barrier, I suppose. And you use these little uh, blue plastic cap nails. And uh, it tells you how often you're supposed to put 
these nails in. I've not finished it yet. We just wanted to get it up here before the storm. So, that's pretty much what we did in a nutshell. I apologize for missing those two steps. Uh, the OSB board was installed uh, about maybe 1.30 or so, maybe 2 o'clock, <laughs> until about 5.30. And the uh, underlayment we started putting in after that, and it was night, so I was swinging a hammer trying to hit those nails in the dark. Um, because that next day on Friday, we had our uh, snow. So, glad that the roof is on. Uh, the tin has been ordered, or the metal, so that's coming up next. Thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.